Ain't nobody gonna be working at it. I mean, come on. What is going on back up in here? You too. Guess this is how the next episode start off. Gotta get the money washed out. Indeed, I need a trailer wash out. I don't really know where I'm at, but it's gotta be cleaned out. Got my man back here, he's doing a good job. Look at all that dirt coming out. Kinds of dirt. Yeah, so if you come out here, you never know, you might have to get a trailer wash out too. Hey, I get some reefer fuel. They wouldn't let me in the gate. They didn't have enough fuel. It didn't matter. It was real, real nasty enough. Going to do my pre trip inspection real quick. Do a little something, something. Got something going on up in here. Got a little leak. Oh no, it ain't nothing. It's just a reefer. Making sure we ain't splattering oil or something all over the place. Gotta get a visual look first. You gotta visually look and see. I got some damage going on right here. Somebody done crashed the money. I don't know how they hit, hit it right there. It's, Usually all the damage we back up from people wrapping around poles. I don't know what this is. I'm gonna try to speculate. I'm thinking it was a pole right here. I don't know. It don't look like it looked like something hit it from something hit it from underneath. Maybe a rock or something. I don't see no damage nowhere else so. Check the mud flap, mud flap look alright. I don't know, maybe a rock or something hit it. So this is what it looks like. Out here in the middle of... I don't know where we at. Just out in the country, in the world. Me in the truck. Hey, give me some fuel in this, y'all. Give me some fuel. Tank's running, running kind of low. Let me get that taken care of. And I want to get some neon lights put on. I don't know if y'all seen them. I've been seeing some Camaros. They got like a, as the tire is spinning, it's like a light or something. They kind of spin with it. I don't know if y'all ever seen that before. I don't know how they go, but 
I'm gonna try to look for some. Make my uh make my rims light up. Okay, and that everything in here is all good. I ain't got no hood seal leak. Got good tread though. Ever since I switched trucks, they gave me some new tires. Or some better tires. First they was bald. Yeah, it's all good. Got my little step ladder. Let's see how it's coming along, YouTube. See how it's coming along. Look at all that dirt. It's all kinds of dirt back out. All kinds. All these tires over here. Got an old school tractor over there. Real old school. I bet it still works too. I bet it still works. Do me a little sweeper right quick. I finally got my permit book. I don't think I put that video out. When I first got my truck, y'all, I didn't have my permit book. And I didn't even know it. I was riding dirty. I was riding real dirty. But we got all that taken care of. Got that taken care of quick. I got my permit book now. Now I ain't riding dirty no more. Got this little ghetto, ghetto little brush thing they gave us. I need to give me an upgrade, give me a real one. You get the job done though. You get the job done. I need some water and some bleach though to get all this uh, concrete stuff up. Mostly just rocks. And then I'm a I'm thinking about buying me a real fire extinguisher too, cause I know if something catch on fire, I ain't even gonna, you know what I'm saying? This right here ain't gonna save your life. It's just gonna, it's not gonna do anything. It's not gonna do anything. I'm gonna give me a real fire extinguisher. Like the ones the firefighters be having. I need one from, from here to there. That's about how long I need it. A little wide, I'm gonna put it, put it right in there. That way if a, a real fire happen, we can put it out. Versus, but this right here is to pretend like you're putting it out. For, this is just, I don't know what it is, maybe it's for insurance purposes. So, so you can tell them uh, you tried to put it out because it ain't gonna put nothing out. And I know some suit and tie guy probably sitting at the desk. I'm pretty sure they ran all kinds of scientific experiments on how this right here can put out a truck fire. I ain't seen it done yet in real life. One time, not one time. Cost me forty dollars. Got me a little receipt right here. We don't need that. Do we got some daily pay action? Let me check. I ain't been checking. Daily pay. I don't see no payments, y'all. I mean, I didn't get paid, but the thing was, I was on my home time, and uh, for whatever reason, if, if the truck ain't running, it ain't gonna receive no messages, so while I was at home, I mean, I already know the money's already in my bank account, but I was gonna show you all the pay statement, but we don't get the pay statements unless the truck is on. Gotta clean it up around here. I just came off home time. I got a new headset. Check me out. Let me grab the box real quick. This is what I got right here. Maybe I'll do a review on it. It's the LG. I ran at Walmart. He had to give me something right quick. I have a new headset. People keep calling. Try not to crash. I like the style, but I don't really like these buds right here. It ain't fell out my ear yet, but 
I don't really like the style, but it's all right. Next, we're going to get a CB radio soon. Sooner or later, I have one. I just ain't got one yet. But up to the next, this is our episode. I don't know what episode this is. I think this is going to be episode 11 or 12. I ain't put up a couple of episodes yet. But if y'all want to know what today's date is, today is the 21st. It's Monday. I don't know when y'all gonna see this video, but just to give you a perspective of how long it takes. Gotta get out. Look. Yeah, all this money. You don't get no tired of this. Oh yes, indeed. Gotta go back here and look. It's all about looking, baby. You look. You put that land to get out. You be all right. This was kind of tight. I hit the blind side up in here. Y'all know I don't like blind side. It's all illegal and shit. Oh man, see that? I'm gonna tell y'all what happened. If you see something like this, that mean he hit it. He tried to pull up. He tried to pull up, make it look like nothing happened. This is what the money look like now. Y'all see I washed it out. Nice and squeakly clean. Got a little screw right there. Going to, oh man, it's too watery. I'll leave that in there. Yes, indeed. And that's, I know, I know what you're thinking. It's empty, I know. But this is what I'm picking up. Oh, yes, indeed. Picking up the money. The money is already loaded today. Do me a little, little uh, inspection. Uh, like that. I don't like this tire right there. Got some tread depth missing. It's an old trailer. Got some rusty tandem action going on. See that? Got my little lines are too low to the ground. Gonna have to get that fixed. Got the mud flap working. Y'all wanna know why I'm hitting it? I beat the hell out the tire, that's how you know. You don't know if it ain't no good, it might blow in your face. Got no tan to match it. Like I said, need to get that fits. I'm gonna check the rest of it in a minute. What trailer is this? For me right here, like I said, I'm dropping it nice and clean. They can put some more money in now. Some more money. Oh, I know my tires are nice and good. I check my brakes too. I know I be getting up under there, don't worry. Drop my trailer. That leave me got some room. I remember this step now. I always do this first. Yes indeed. They don't put this on the CDL test. And that's why you be seeing people drop trailers because it ain't part of their test. You know what I'm saying? They put this on the CDL test. And you won't have people dropping trailers, not putting the land to get out. Put that light down. Chopped it off for the full tank of gas now. Only thing wrong with my trailer, somebody done crashed it. Oh yeah, they wrapped it around a pole. I can't really figure out what happened though. Put that in now. So this is that weird, that weird world experience that y'all ain't no good. I'm trying to show you with my YouTube channel. Let's see what I was looking. I was looking to get in the truck and I ain't seen no videos of the actual job. I just saw people talking about it. I ain't seen nobody do it. And that's what I'm here to show y'all. What it's actually like to do it. I don't want to hear about it. I want to see you doing it. This is 
part of the job now. See this right here? You gotta pull that to release the trailer with the land to get out. If the land to get in down, you pull this and drive off. Oh man. They might pistol whip you in the parking lot. I always check to make sure both down. Sometimes the other one might not go down. You know what I'm saying? And there's the truck then cut off. Just gonna get in here, drop the empty one, pick up the money. Truck cut off. Y'all almost didn't want to start back up on me. Show y'all another problem you might encounter. You see this? I pulled up the bag into the money, but I stopped, stopped a little early. I'm gonna show y'all why. See that right there? They go to Kingpin. You see how this the top of the trailer need to be on top of that plate. If it ain't on top of the plate, what's gonna happen? That Kingpin ain't gonna be on the other side of this and you're gonna be stuck under there. Somebody gonna have to come in and find a way to get you out. Let me get a closer view. Let me get up here now. And what I need to do is I need to let the I need to let this down so that the top of my trailer is on that skid plate. But I gotta pull back forward because I'm crooked. Cause it didn't happen to me before. I already got stuck under a trailer. And as you can see, I get out and look at it every time because it ain't gonna ever happen again.